This is my new bulking diet. It consists of five healthy meals with a total of 3,500 calories. I've been using this diet for the past couple months and the results have been unmatched. I feel the best I ever have. I'm the strongest I've ever been. So changing to this diet was the best decision I ever made. But firstly, why even listen to me? Well, here's a little backstory of myself. I've always been the skinny kid. As soon as I started the gym, the diet aspect was without a doubt the hardest part for me. I could never get enough calories in. This has led me to over my time at the gym trying many different bulking strategies. Dirty bulking, clean-ish bulking, a whole range of different types. But none of them have come close to this new diet I'm on now. So without further ado, let me share it with you. 10.30 right now, let's get this full day of eating started. Okay, so meal number one, bagels with chicken and ketchup, two of them, 200 milliliters of cranberry juice, and then 400 milliliters of orange juice. Oh yeah, there's one more thing we need. The most overdramatic supplement entrance. We also have some creatine with this. Just a quick plug, if you don't want to get any creatine yourself, go to myprotein.com, add the creatine to your cart, and then at checkout, enter code JOE, which will save you 37% off your entire order. It helps me out, and it also gets you cheaper creatine. Okay, let's get this downers. After I consume my meal, I'll do some sort of work, or I'll do editing, or I'll do skating. Just any activity, but the important part being, I have about two to two and a half hours between each meal. Which then swiftly brings us on to meal two. Chicken, rice, and broccoli. The typical bodybuilder meal. We've got protein from the chicken, carbs from the rice, and nutrients from the veg. It's a perfect meal. A lot of people would say this is bland, and I can see where you're coming from. However, me, my housemate Hal, we both just love eating this meal. And because it's so good for you, it's a win-win. Yeah, let's get this uh, meal number two downers. Boom, delicious. Okay, so the time right now is 20 to 6. We've got meal number three, aka the pre workout meal, and of course, it's more chicken. To make this meal, you cook some chicken, add some fajita sauce to that, and then add them to three beautiful wraps. Each wrap has a chunky 288 calories in, and they're so easy to get down. Okay, so heading to the gym right now. I've got my two square bars. I now have these before every single workout. They're basically just fast acting sources of carbs. So they go into the system quickly, give me a lot of energy for the workout and they also increase the pump. I've got legs today on my new program and trust me, it is the hardest workout I've ever done in my life. So I'm gonna need these. Wish me luck. Let's destroy some legs. Style too dangerous, rhymes too murderous, beats too treacherous, you can't get with this. We set it off and you scramble like you under attack. But don't run, that booming sound is just a banging track. Camel, crooked J Root do more damage than the razor back. Space age, forget the block, I cock the laser back. Scientific madness, reppin' still a weapon, carbon black. So be your long, we dropping bombs, not fiction but fact. I swing the mic and chop it down like a lumberjack. We about to blow it up, so where my people at? People at, people at. Uh, ah, that was brutal. I've still got to do arms when I get back home. It's gonna be, um, it's gonna be a struggle to drive back, but leg session absolutely smashed. At the end of most leg sessions, I'll do a bit of arms just because I really want to build them up. This is how my physique's looking so far. Not satisfied in the slightest, but I'm happy with the progress. Okay, so straight after my workout, I will have 80 grams of Cocoa Pops with 300 milliliters of blue milk. The reason I have Cocoa Pops, they've got a lot of sugar, they replenish glycogen levels in the body. And then with that, we also have another beautiful chicken wrap. I get my second to last meal down and then it brings me on to meal number five, aka the last meal. A protein shake, Greek yogurt and dark chocolate. The final meal and the meal to conclude this video. I'm really happy with the diet so far. I want to clarify, this specific day is what I eat on a training day. I also have a different diet for the non-training day, which if you want to see, comment down below and I'll do it. Here is the specific portion sizes of today's diet if you want to recreate it yourself. Cheers, guys. 
Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed, I'd really appreciate it if you could hit the like button and maybe also consider subscribing. And lastly, if you want to get any supplements like protein powder, creatine, pre-workout, head over to my protein, which is the first link in the description. Use my code Joe at checkout, which will save you 37% off your entire order. Not only is it the cheapest way to get supplements, but it also helps me out a ton. Cheers, guys.